Aston Villa have terminated the contract of Steven Gerrard after 11 months in charge. The decision has shocked many, with him being a legendary figure of the game and one of Britain's most talented players of the 21st century. Gerrard joined Aston Villa from Rangers in November 2021 and now his future looks uncertain following his sacking by the Premier League club. The ex-Liverpool captain has been a relatively successful coach with his spells both at Liverpool under-18s and at Glasgow Rangers, but could this setback jeopardise his coaching career? Perhaps he will return to punditry, particularly with the Qatar World Cup on the horizon. I'm sure as we speak, the channels, BT Sports, BBC, etc. are on the phone to him and his agents right now. I'm also quite certain he will return to club management, although at what level remains to be seen. Is Stevie the type of person to hold out for another Premier League opportunity in a similar way to Frank Lampard did with Everton after his sacking by Chelsea? Will he drop to the Championship and help a club striving for that Premier League glory? My theory is mixed. Roy Keane flirted at that level of football as a manager, and from many reports, he struggled to accept a player's limitations, possibly compared to those of his own during his heyday as Manchester United's successful captain. Gerard might see things differently. He had a good ground in the world of coaching with Liverpool under 18s. With that would have come many learning opportunities around player development, as well as looking after a group of players who might well have had the mouths wide open when listening to this Liverpool legend. There is of course also the opportunity that he might take a break from football. Gerard is a father of three daughters and a five-year-old son, so he might decide to take time out of the game and enjoy family life for a while. After all, he has been involved in the professional football setup more or less continually since the age of nine. Within two months of retiring as a player, he accepted the coaching role at Liverpool. A may decide now is the time for a sabbatical. Gerard received a lot of attention as a potential Liverpool manager ever since he transitioned into coaching. His reputation was bolstered by his success at Rangers, which ended Celtic's stranglehold of the Scottish Premiership in 2021 and the transfer to Villa was viewed as the next logical step on his journey to the Anfield hot seat. That development has encountered its first roadblock. At the very least, it represents a setback in the anticipated timeline for landing his ideal job. There is still plenty of time for Gerald to restore the harm to his managing reputation because the current Reds manager Jurgen Klopp's contract runs until 2026 and it's quite improbable that he will be fired before that expires. For now, he will always be remembered as the player who gave everything to his club and his country, but who ultimately failed to succeed as manager at Aston Villa. The work he would have put in behind the scenes and the sacrifices managers make will all seem like it wasn't worth it for a moment. However, as Jurgen Klopp alluded to in his press conference, setbacks are a part of life and it is how we respond that really defines us as people. Whatever the immediate future holds for Steven Gerrard and from one coach to another, I would like to use my platform here on YouTube and wish him all the very, very best. Stay well, my friend. With that would have come many learning.